So um, as we make our way down ha Hastings Street, uh, this is where you have to become friends with your uh, neighbors on this walk and just squeeze up a little bit so that we don't hog the entire sidewalk. So we'll, we'll squeeze up against the building this way. Um, yeah, so, and we're just going to walk down Hastings towards Columbia and then uh, turn down Columbia and get back to our starting point uh, uh, where we'll wrap things up. Uh, but coming out to Hastings, uh, Hastings is, of course, the street that everyone knows and knows for all the wrong reasons, uh, usually. It's the shorthand for what's wrong with the city. Everyone talks about East Hastings and everyone else goes, oh, yeah. Um, however, Hastings, East Hastings, um, is and was a very important street uh, in this community. Uh, for the first thing, it has um, a number of social service agencies along it that are very important to the community. And certainly as you go up over the hill towards uh, Strathcona, you get into a number of uh, interesting housing projects. The Union Gospel Mission is down that way as well. So again, a lot of services for the community that are here, um, but it's also the contact point for most folks and their visual sense of the neighborhood because this is one of the major routes into town and if you only based your perception on this neighborhood by what you could see as you drove by very quickly um, well that's why you get headlines in the newspaper like they uh, write because that seems all they do sometimes and probably the worst example of that was our dear old CBC that should know better did that whole thing once where they came down and squatted on the street and kind of went out and found all of the worst little bits of the neighborhood and then screamed it across the national headlines. And it's like, oh, please, don't do that. And every garbage strike that we have in the city of Vancouver, the first thing you do is you come down and photograph the lanes, photograph the lanes of the downtown east side and then show that as the results of the garbage strike. And But the fact is that the lanes need cleaning up and the city won't clean them up. And, they photograph these things regardless of garbage strikes or not. But so the shorthand for this, the neighborhood becomes a shorthand for things that are wrong with the city. And Hastings is unfortunately one of those things that just is the shorthand. And it's not necessarily true. On this corner, uh, we actually have uh, an institution that uh, has been around in the neighborhood for a very long time, uh, just across the street, First United Church. Uh, this is the second building on the site. The, the first one, which was as First Presbyterian, was this big neo-Gothic wood structure with one of the tallest steeples in town. Um, it was the home for Reverend Roden, uh, who had the radio show as well as uh, out in uh, speaking engagements and a real firebrand out and around the community. During the Great Depression, he was out visiting all of the uh, various camps for the unemployed down at the Hastings Mill site and more importantly down on False Creek and he was out uh, with the kitchen providing the food and, and the outreach and various things like that and a real advocate for uh, this neighborhood and the church has always been an advocate and so one of the schemes right now that's being promoted is the fact that the church itself uh, tears itself down and rebuilds as a housing project but with community space and other amenities for the community that's that's here and so that uh, fundraising is in process um, as we 